Hey, what is up, guys? And today we're gonna be here in Clown Mechanic Simulator fixing up this a wide body Acura NSX. I found it in the junkyard. It is a junkyard find, as you can tell by all the rust. Missing a lot of body panels, but we're gonna fix it up. I didn't want to move it over. Let's move it where that's to actually go, because that would probably help. Alright. I guess we will start by getting these panels off and fixing them. everything so it has 9,000 miles on it it should have a v6 yep, v6 but it looks good even without panels on it it looks pretty good so I guess let's go over here Go ahead and do the interior. Fix up all that rust. Look at that. That's a really bright red. Holy moly. Alright. I guess we can start fixing up everything on here. Some of this stuff back on. Side, which I can't get to because it's on the lift. While we're here, we can take off the rim jar. And here I'll take the drive axle. Alright, so all the tires are out. Let's go ahead and see if I can find the battery. Yep. Brake servo, ABS pump. Um, that way to get from under the car. So what about in this engine? Is there anything we have to take out right now? Can't take out the tag. So we're not right here, we might as well. Um, shafts. Now take out this head. None of these have the end, the, ca the rod caps on them. We can just take the whole block out right now. Nice. Okay, so we can take this whole block out now. All we have to do is grab that crank, pull the crank out, and then we can take the whole engine block out. There it is. Alright. Oh, I have to go back in the engine bed to remove it. Well, okay. I guess for now, we'll just kind of finish with the suspension work and get all that done. We can do the engine last.
tie rod, steering rack, just like that, all of the suspension work is done on this car. So there's no more suspension left. So now we can drop it back down to get the engine block out. Alright, there we go. I was able to get in. Alright, so there's the engine block. Now let's see what exactly we can fix. Too bad. Alrighty. Well, let's get it up on the lift. Try to put everything back in. keep the same tire size or just bump it up a little bit. Uh, how's it looking in the front? About the same, so maybe bump it up just a little bit. Not too much, but just, just a slight bit. But from there, we have to try to get in the engine here. Alright, there we go. Let's stop the engine base done. Now we just have to do the actual engine.
completed. So we'll take it off. We have to take the engine crane, put on car lifter A, and we can put back in that V6 engine. Oh wait, no, I didn't want to pull it out. No! I wanted to put it back. There we go. Now that's all done. Now the engine is done. Is there an engine cover back here? Nope, that is it. Can I get to that steering wheel back here? Nope, okay. Alright, so now all we have to do is the wheels. So what were these wheels? Were those. So this had 275 3020s all the way around. this red okay there are no other liveries okay. now do I want to keep it this red or do I want to change the color kind of like that red like black I think black would look really good too oh yeah the most comfortable accurate NSX wide body you've ever sat in at least. Right, so let's go ahead and put on the dyno. So I want to see what sort of power this car is making. So as you can read stock it was making 251 horsepower and 221 foot pounds of torque. Let's see if we can get that. Quality 50 parts. 
spot as it's base. That's pretty good. Alright guys, so as you can see, this is our final product, and man, would you look at it. It's a really good looking collar. Wow. Really good looking. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, if you liked the video, leave a like, comment, say that you want more of these kinds of videos, rebuilding cars, a car mechanic simulator. If you want to see more of these, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so that you get notified every time I drop a video. But uh, as I always say, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next episode.